Welcome to Fishing with Doomsday Dan and Bobby and Little Anthony, my two sons. Here they are with little bass they caught. There's my bass. Here we are in South Carolina. Fish on. It is so beautiful here in South Carolina. That's right. Only Doomsday Dan can bring you fishing in South Carolina. Just trying to catch a couple little brim so we can use them and turn around and catch a bigger fish like a bass. Wow. That good bass. One little hit, I go call yourself. Yeah, like, damn, they just <laughs> piranhas, man. Damn, dude. Nice. Yeah, we tried with a Christmas tree earlier to catch some little brim so we can use them like shiners, but really didn't have any good luck. They're kind of too big. So now we're down to using our live worms. I tried some uh, some lures, some, some uh, deep divers. I tried some hopping lures. Nothing. This could be also the time of day. That's all right, because it is so beautiful here and nice and calm. Put your mind at ease and go fishing with Doomsday Day. And we're at the, the dam here, which you just saw the other side of the creek. So all the water is kind of pushing, so the water flow is going this way. So it kind of brings my bait. This way. Okay, we're just trying a little different, a little different spot in the white waters here. Hey, y'all.
read this block with to lure. See how the hooks go inside of the rubber tubing. Definitely want to get one of those if you're fishing anywhere around rocks or weed. Got a shallow here, but they give it a shot anyway. Some of the little bit of scenery. Love it here. A nice little minnow Back on to the here. Fish. We're at a different lake. We're at Mills, Old Mill Pond Park. South Carolina. Out of this. For some reason, Dizzy Dan always fishes where he's not supposed to. We think that's the little dock, though, so. Got that little minnow on it, just kind of get him a little jerk and reel. I went to try a little torpedo popper. Don't get my torpedo, man. A lot of action, they like that. A lot of noise. Jerk it a little and feel and jerk. Alright, got another baby. He didn't like the other one. Not bad, though. All in the day in the life of fishing with Doomsday Dan. Some idiots behind me. Yeah, ah! <laughs> I robbed you. Like half your shoulders. I didn't see you. A quarter pound or something? Half a pound? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's a half a pound. No, he's probably a pound and a half, dude. Cool. Alright, we're gonna go for the live worm. back in Florida. We went 20 hours. We got a captain in South Carolina. We had to come back to our hometown, Florida, to catch some fish. Oh, that's all. Yeah, he's big, guys. He's big. Fish on. Woo! Holy shit. Holy I beat my record! He's got to be three or four pounds. Woo! That's awesome, dude. That is a nice fish. Can you take I want to get a picture with that. <laughs> that would wow. be mine by a That's a five time. point, yeah. It is my record. It's Doomsday Dan's record. You ever calling that big? Nope. Ever? Nope. Never, dude. We were just talking about that. We were just talking about the biggest one I've ever caught was... The biggest one I ever caught was uh, about two, two and a half pounder. Woo! About it. The monster. Yeah, so that is right there. Yeah, yeah this one's got to be yeah, at he's least. He's pretty big, guys. He's my four pounds, record. I'm guessing he's a good four, four and a half pounds. World record, twenty-two and a half. I'm glad pounds. I came back to Florida because I caught my record, baby. Woo, is he nice? The near scale. All right, we got a biggie. Let's get him back in the water. 
Ah, I don't know. I just don't want to let him go yet. <laughs> He's just too beautiful. Alright. There you go. Woo! That was awesome! What a way to finish the show, y'all. Don't forget, guys, follow me on Twitter, Dan Preppin'.